We're always droning on about drones, and to be honest, they look pretty much the same, the ones that you and I might be able to buy. But I bet you haven't seen one like this before. It's, um, it's a pocket-sized drone. But tell me, how have you made this and why? Uh, we do research on the Technical University of Delft on uh, very small drones. Uh, we made electronics to make it completely autonomous. And this is the smallest open source autonomous drone. So why are you flying it with a remote control now? Because we're now indoor in the building uh, and uh, there's no GPS uh, connection indoor. So when we are flying outdoor, then I can uh, let it fly completely autonomous from my smartphone. If I touch it now, will the autopilot, as it were, kick in? Yeah. So you can see that it's uh, contracting your, uh, your input. And this has a camera on it. Can you fly it around a bit so, so we can see the kind of views it would give yeah. you? Yeah. So we can see in the, in the room yeah. what's happening. This is quite lightweight, but we know for the bigger drones, there's quite strict regulations about where you can fly them because of people's safety. How safe is this? Yeah, so the goal uh, why we're doing research on very small drones is to make them inherently safe. So uh, if this falls on top of your head or uh, it hits an obstacle, it doesn't uh, matter because they are very lightweight. They only weigh 20 grams. And uh, yeah, we try to make them even smaller than this size so that they're really getting safe and uh, can be used inside city environments. How do you imagine people using these? In uh, 2008, in our uh, university, a faculty was uh, burning. So when I, I saw that, uh, I took a drone and uh, launched it in the air and we got immediately uh, some, some images from, uh, from above. And we could uh, clearly see where the fire was spreading. And this gave us an idea to make very small drones. In the beginning, when uh, a smartphone was launched, nobody needed a smartphone. Nobody knew why, why would I need a smartphone in five years. Yeah. And then everybody could not live without their smartphone anymore because they want to check Facebook constantly. And the same will happen with this kind of small drones. Gathering data, getting information, that's basically why you, you need these kind of drones.